We originally evolved as nomadic hunter-gatherers. The hunter-gatherer is the person who finds the bulrushes and the berries and so on. And they don't store food. They simply find food where they find it and they consume it on the spot. The blood type of these hunter-gatherers is the blood type O. They are the ultimate in being able to eat proteins because they hunted and berries. What they stored was pemmican, which was a blend of dried blueberries with bear fat or something like that. You know, high fat, some berries mixture. Anyway, agriculture was introduced, fertile valleys between Euphrates and Tigris rivers 6,000 years ago or thereabouts. And it only got going in a big way sometime in the days of the Roman Empire. That's the Western side of things. On the Eastern side of things in China, they have definitely cultivated rice and have been storing energy in that way for a few thousand years. So with the evolution of agriculture, we have found a way to store energy in the form of carbohydrate, a starch. So grains, which comes from grass, that is being rice, wheat, barley, rye, and then in North America, corn. These were plants that were cultivated as a stored energy. Visualize this. The sunshine, photons, arrive on the planet from the sun. And these photons are converted into starch through the means of photosynthesis. So you're taking carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and sunlight, and you're storing them into this hydrocarbon starch. Now a starch chemically is a string of glucose.